like I'm live. Hello everyone, Lady Rogue Gaming here, coming at you with another late night stream, uh, or hangout, whatever, you know, you know the drill by now, you know how these things go. We were building the, um, the warehouse last night. Last night? Yeah, last night. I stream like every night now, pretty much. So it's hard to remember exactly what nights I've been streaming and what nights I haven't been. Huh. It's weird. It looks like the brightness on my screen is less than it had been. Okay. Uh, we were up in the trophy hall instead of the tavern, uh, because after the last stream I had logged back on to show my brother around the town. But nothing else was done in that time besides running and falling. All right, we gotta make some more food real quick. Wow, I didn't think we'd run out of cloud berries. Um, yeah, we'll just grab all 20. I think I have the turnips still. Hey, hello, hello. How's it going? Thank you for popping in. How was, um, how was stream? You were, uh, streaming Age of Empires, right? Or were you doing more Kenshi tonight? going great chilling bed ready to sleep oh yeah i get that you saw me on got excited oh well thank you oh well hell yeah hell yeah see um what was it i tried age of empires 2 a little bit and i'm just like i don't do um strategy a whole lot i don't know uh especially like rts i more focus on uh the chill games but if I were to do strategy, it'd be uh, turn-based, definitely. Uh, it gives my my simple, simple brain more time to think. Hey, Bryco, how's it going? Welcome. I wasn't even gonna stream tonight, believe it or not. You're not the best, but you really are enjoying AOE. Well, hell yeah, I'm happy to hear that. You don't always have to be good at a game to enjoy it kind of thing. I'm trash at most games I play, so. I think the m math on this would be 30? I don't even know. Okay, let's get some food. If I can get... There we go. Yeah, I... I was uh, hanging out with my sister and uh, her husband and we were playing Factorio and uh, when I got home I don't even know like 40 minutes ago now and fucking I was hungry so I got McDonald's on the way home uh, I got me a 10 piece nuggy meal uh, I am a basic bitch when it comes to that but you know nothing wrong with that uh, and then I was just sitting here, I was about to find something to play, and then I'm like, you know, I really want to play Valheim, so let's stream. Uh, let's see. quarter pounder with Big Mac sauce. Oh no. Uh, 
See, I, I'm more of a Wendy's girl, but uh, Wendy's closed uh, at uh, 11, and I wasn't heading home until after 11, so I was like, well, shit. No Wendy's for me. <laughs> Also, I don't know how to count with the entrails. I forgot it takes four per, not three per. I do this every time. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. We have more than enough. Canes? I'm not sh familiar with that. I mean, yeah. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. I yes cannot count. <laughs> I never claim to be smart, and I never will. <laughs> Raising Canes is a fast food place that only serves chicken tenders. That they have this amazing cane sauce. Oh, okay. Counting is hard. Queer person, me. <laughs> Okay, um, I didn't mean to bring all this sausage with me. Uh. No, that's not the right chest. What am I doing? There we go. If only my brain could work. Oh, oh, thank you. This is this is just the tavern uh, soda. Um, my my house, which is still, I need to decorate more. It has not had the love that it deserves. Um, or if you mean base, as in like all of this. Um, the the town's name is uh, Stoneport. I need to get a sign up for it still somewhere. But uh, this building over here is my house. Um, there's a lot that still needs to be done. We were working on the new, uh, warehouse just the last time I was playing, which was last night, but, um, I'll, I'll give a little run through. The house isn't as decorated as I would like, uh, got my living room in here, which, here, boom, now we got the fire going. Uh, definitely want to get some item stands on top of the mantle and then put something up there. I don't know what yet. And then this is my dining hall. Very much just I have a table. That is it. The architect of your Valheim group that pleases you greatly. Oh, as the architect of your group, this pleases you greatly. Okay, well, good, good. I'm glad to hear. Uh, I appreciate getting praise on my builds. It makes me feel very good. <laughs> Um, and then I have this little back entrance here that leads down to the bottom. I have this stone foundation here built. I need to, uh, uh, build a dock off of it so I can get, you know, put some boats out here. Uh, we've got the, the portal platform over here. This took me, like, literally four streams, I think, to finish. Um, but after I built the, the base of it, I was like, what? Hold on, why am I giving a tour at night anyway? Let, let me not be a dingus. Let me go sleep real quick. And then I can finish giving the little tour of down here. But, um, after I built the base of the portal platform, I, was, I looked at it and I'm like, why, why did I do this to myself? How the fuck am I going to build a roof for it? But the roof actually turned out, um, pretty decent. Uh, to be fair, oh shoot, I failed to, to pin the, the game modifiers in chat, hold on. Um, to be fair, I do have three times resource collection on, so it doesn't take as long, but it still does take quite a while. Get that pinned, okay. Uh, I have the game modifiers there, I try to be, uh, transparent with that stuff, I don't want people to think like, oh, this is, um, a pure uh, playthrough. It's like, no, 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 we're playing boosted with casual experience, but uh, very much still like, yeah, taking taking credit for the fact that I've done all of this legitimately. 
boosted or not. Um, and then each section is is labeled for the platforms. I only have 15 portals in, and one of them or two of them aren't used right now. Um, but then we've got the the random locations. The last one was the boss locations, and then we've got resource locations here, uh, which some of these can change eventually because depending upon where the portal needs to go. Uh, I'm gonna probably take that off now. Oops. There we go. Uh, and then running over here, uh, past all the garden stuff, this is the warehouse that I was working on. Um, I need to get the, the shelves finished putting in, or finish putting them whatever whatever English is hard um, and then I'll get lights in here uh, and I have this set up I need to put a portal in here I just don't have the gray dwarf eyes currently but then I'm gonna have chests all along that that wall too and we'll, we'll have so much storage space because I'm gonna stack them up to four thank you thank you I, I do appreciate it uh, I've got my little cart corral here as well uh, and let's see we've got oh the trophy hall let me go show that real quick which I need to finish pushing this hill back level out the the foundation and then there's going to be a staircase ran up along this part to the top here so then it's all just connected I can give a little panoramic view of the town as well but it's coming along uh, I wasn't planning on making it this big when I started but I should have expected um, something of the sorts I can't help but build like a big project but then this is my my trophy hall I wanted to go very extravagant for it um, we've got the big table I need to get all the food and mead laid out along it still but that's gonna be a whole stream collecting the food materials the most beautiful location thank you thank you um, I'm gonna get all of the the creature heads in here including all of the boss heads but more importantly we have the the follower wall uh, which I really wanted to do uh, and community engagement and all of that as much as I can is super important to me so but yeah we have plenty of wall space to get the wall item stand set up and I need to get more blue jute to finish wrapping it around on the the beams along the ceiling yeah you're on the wall you're uh, so it's in like chronological order of like who followed so that's like first and then the more recent followers go up top so you can see you were on there pretty early on oh yeah Braco of course you're on the wall we got all the followers there uh, <laughs> hell yeah we are falling uh, but yeah no community engagement I want to be very big with super important you have a tiny shack by Beck's possibly old base <laughs> Well, good. I'm glad you were honored. I'm, I'm glad that I, I can do something nice for my followers, even if it's little. Um, I am currently in the works on getting a PC build figured out, and then I'm going to start buying parts. So then hopefully I can be a more proper streamer and stream from a PC and have proper integrations for extensions and everything. So then we can have even better interactions in chat and all of that. Okay, so let's, uh, yeah, let's, let's grab some wood and head back, or I think the wood's already over there, yeah, no, let's head back and then, uh, do some building. Every now and again, I, I like to give the tour. I need to, um, run around, uh, at some point and just clip a bunch of the buildings so that way I have just a bunch of clips so people can see what I've been doing here okay let me 
Uh, boom. We'll grab that one. So yeah, this will be a slow process. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Uh, I've been trying my best. Uh, there's been some streams where it's like, uh, I feel like I didn't talk as much as I could have, but I don't like beat myself up over it. I'm just like, you know, it was a more chill stream. And usually those nights are nights that I worked and decided to stream anyway. And then my brain's just like, ugh, why'd you do this? But then it's like, I'm still having a good time. Uh, But yeah, definitely, uh, the graphics, uh, the, the current gen of Xbox, definitely, they, they shoved good hardware in it. I'm very happy that I am able to stream as I am currently, even if it's not the end goal set up. <laughs> Certifiable 10 out of 10 streamer. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate both of you. I, my whole support group, community, whatever that I've slowly been growing here has been amazing. I appreciate everyone so much. Like, it's actually insane. In the last month, I've gotten, like, I don't even know, like, uh, 19 followers or some shit like that. I'm just like, what the hell? Uh, where are you people coming from? Uh, <laughs> it's amazing. It's truly amazing. That's why I want to try to be able to do what I can to give back to the community in in the most reasonable ways. Your viewers are your happiness, so you completely understand. <laughs> See, like, I wasn't even... Um, really getting into the streaming thing to like uh I don't even know to like really like I was just here for a good time and that things have been been growing so much recently I'm like okay I'm gonna go ahead and f focus on it a bit more than I had been um or like be a little more serious than I was initially planning to be with it and I'm just like all right uh th this has been a blast like I haven't streamed a single time being like, oh, I have to stream. Like, I just don't want to. Uh, and it's funny because uh, I, I've i been neglecting my YouTube channel. That's not funny, but um, it's okay. There, uh, it's not. It's really not. Don't let me lie. It's not okay. But uh, I need to actually work on that a bit more. Uh, I've been slack a lacking, but it's... It's sl slowly but surely. I am getting stuff figured out, like scheduling wise, and I'm getting things ironed out with my job so uh, I have a more consistent schedule because that'll help me keep on track with stuff a lot better if I'm working consistent hours and stuff. It's just, it's difficult working like a fast food job because. Uh, the the scheduling just isn't there. Yeah, yeah, it is hard to balance all the stuff. And yeah, editing, like, it's so tedious. I don't mind it, and it's satisfying when it's done, but like, my god, sometimes I'm just like, I don't want to. And that's why with the streaming, it's just been so much fun. It's like, I don't even really have to try, like, it's just, we're just hanging out. <laughs> Scheduling, what's that? I mean, honestly, though, um, I need to get a fucking sleep schedule worked out. God damn. Um, I went to bed at, like, 6 a.m., and then I woke up at, like, 1 p.m., and was like, oh, I guess I should get up. <laughs> And we're probably going to do the same thing again tonight. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead and finish this out to the other side.
and then we're definitely gonna have to go get uh, black scrap metal tonight because um, we don't have very much. Oh no, does this not line up evenly? Oh no, fuck, because there's um. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, easy fix. Fortunately, we didn't get too far with it. Uh, we'll just pull it out one more. And, like, push everything over to the left one more tile. I'm glad we noticed now. Could have been a lot worse. Okay. So we do that. And then that. But yeah, no, scheduling is um, a very foreign term to me. Uh, I try to... I used to have a sleep schedule. It was really nice. Um, I was waking up at like 8 a.m. every morning, just naturally. I woke up with energy. I didn't need a cup of coffee every morning. Now I just like wake up. I'm just like, don't talk to me. I need my coffee, damn it. <laughs> Or like caffeine has just become uh, a necessity at this point. It's not great, but you know, we vibing. Okay, and I can break that one. Oh yeah, and also let me. Fix this. We'll just do this then. Okay. There we go. Problem solved. Alrighty, that lines up. Now we gotta get the other part of the shelf. And then um, we'll start working on getting the, the shelf for the next level. Oh, right. I might need to place it in here. Only my brain could work for once, but that's asking way too much. A functional brain? What's that? Like, honestly. We we only roll neuro spicy around here. Okay, so let me go ahead and get those poles in there, too. That'll bug me if I don't. Okay, let's run back to this side, because... Oh, I did start it. Cool. Thanks, past me. You do care about me. Usually, past me says, fuck you, future me. Deal with it later. Nine times out of ten, my response to an issue? Ah, that's a problem for future me. Especially when I start to get tired, because, oh my god, when the grog hits, I'm just donezo. Oh my god. Yeah, my camera's pushed in as far as it can go. Oh, here we go. Okay, that works. Blessed be the building gods. Is that... Yeah, I mean, that must be snapped. Duh. There's not a snap point on the wall right there. What kind of stupid question was that? <laughs> What's wrong with me? Uh... No, yeah, we can... We can hop. We got the hops. We, we got... What, what's our hop? Uh... We got 74 hop. Oh, you're all right. Thank you for popping in. I really do appreciate it. Uh, I hope you have 
a wonderful rest. And I'll try to pop in on your next stream. Until next time, Soda. Oh yeah, I might need to go all the way back. Back to the beginning when there were dinosaurs. No. Oh here, here I'll be like every um, every meathead on the internet. Uh, oh, you know what Valheim's missing? This game's not good. It needs guns. Like the people that are like, oh, Minecraft needs guns. That's that's where that logic came from. I don't know, I don't know why, where that came from, why that popped in my brain. <sighs> Gotta love just being an airhead and random ass shit just popping up. Okay, I, I'm a special kid. It's okay. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. I'm like, it has to be, but like, it looked too low, but it's because of the little, like, support beams on the wall on the inside that made it look weird. Also, I'm glad I didn't fall in there. I'm very clumsy, and that could have very easily happened. Okay, let's get that one. Also, I usually do this, and I completely forgot. How is everyone's night going? Or early morning, depending upon what your time zone is. Why did I do that? It's okay. I can put it right back, but why? My night has been pretty dang good. And I hope the same for all of you. Diggity. All right, we almost have this side of... Oh, wait. No, sorry. We, we'll have one more tier of shelves to do, and then we'll have this side done. And then we do the other side. Yippee. No. <laughs> but, you see, the sun is setting, and we do not work in the dark. Let us sleep. You're doing quite well. You're currently multitasking, aka procrastinating multiple projects at once. Do I understand? Oh my god, yes. <laughs> Me with so many things. There's, there's so many like just construction projects on so many different survival games that I play that I need to get to. There's outside of gaming projects i like to do creative writing on the side although it's been like three no two years since i've done any writing unfortunately uh i would like to get back to it at some point but i'm just lazy um i need to get there's a lot of projects i have planned for my uh youtube channel that i just haven't uh gotten around to some of which I was I've started working on and need to get back to. I've just uh been streaming. I'm busy streaming, not procrastinating. Um definitely not. Uh no. <laughs> um, I'm being productive in other outlets. That's how I like to view it. Uh and then I have some, like, Minecraft projects. Not just, like, build projects, but, like... Uh, because I play Minecraft Bedrock, uh... 
uh, we don't have mods. We have like add-ons, which are like kind of like mods, but n not as good, and like don't have uh, can't, can't use quite as many like external assets. It's a bit more limiting, but um, there's still a lot you can do with it. And uh, I was working on. It started as just uh, playing a Fallout world with the Fallout textures and working on like my own custom textures and overlaying them with the textures that they already provided for the Fallout pack. Because uh, I like like 90% of what they have. There's just some blocks that I'm like, nah, these need to change. And I had already been messing with my own resource packs at that point in Minecraft. Uh, so I decided. Uh, after a certain point, I'm like, okay, I need to just add, make a behavior pack, which is like, which is what the add-ons run through, and, um, so pretty much add-ons are just simplified mods, um, but I was working on, uh, a full, like, Fallout experience inside of Minecraft with as close as I could make it, uh, all the way down to like making ammo and weapons and stuff like that um because there's a lot you could do but we were limited at the time because this was like two years back give or take when i was working on it pretty much when i was active before um making content and all of that i was doing so m many creative projects and then uh i went through a breakup and you know the motivation went out the window as one could imagine um, I deal with depression really bad, and so yeah, that was no fun. Um, I also went through a recent breakup, but fortunately, um, uh, to find any kind of, like, silver lining out of the breakup, um, I, we were not together for very long, so the feelings did not grow as strong as they could have, so I mean, like, the depresso, espresso depresso did not hit quite as hard as it could have, so I guess that's a bright side, but it's still not a great situation, of course. But it's the kind of thing, like, I'll get over it, you know? Time heals all wounds. Um, what, another silver lining I can take out of that relationship is, uh, that kind of got me motivated to get back to creating content and stuff. And, uh, so, it, it is a blessing in disguise, or whatever term you would like to use. Um, yeah, that's, yeah, that's the right spacing. Because if I were, were to place one... Well, we'll pretend like it's lower, yeah, that's right. Um... I guess... Yeah, no, yeah, that'll work. We'll, um... I'll just snap it off of there. It'll clip slightly, but that's fine. Doesn't clip that bad. I'm not opposed to clipping things through. I'm not a fan of it, but with it being an option, it's not horrible. So, those that was just half walls, right? Or, I guess, technically a quarter wall, but I'm making it into vertical half walls. Yeah. Although, it's pointed out. Oh, yeah, because we did this... Ah, the smooth parts on the inside. You know, smooth. Much like my brain. Not a wrinkle on it. Uh... Yes. Okay, hold on. Maybe there's a single wrinkle. I was just trying to think of how I'm going to do that. I actually... I'd like a Jimmy Neutron brain blast there. Is that... Oh, wait. No, never mind. I'm actually stupid. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Um... Log. Log like this. And then... Also... Sorry I'm such a pea brain at times, everyone. Eventually we get there, but like, it takes me a few minutes of struggling. Can I... Can we... Can you... Thank you. So let's try this again. Now will it, uh... Oh, oh, here, here. There we go. 
Oh, wait, no, that, that doesn't work. Um, okay, so I have the right idea, just <laughs> not the right orientation. Hold up, hold up. So... I think that'll work? I don't fucking know, honestly, anymore. I don't know anything. Okay, there we go. Good golly. It's all good in our Valheim neighborhood. We got it, and we survived. We're not worse for wear. And, uh... Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh... I'm trying to think of the easiest way to do it, and I, I'm just gonna put floors along the top here temporarily. And then... Um, yeah, we'll, we'll go grab another stack of wood. Oh, I still have Sprite here. Heck yeah. I thought I finished my drink. Although I forgot to ask for no ice. Uh, I don't really like ice unless it's in water. It waters the drink down and I'm not a fan of that. Um, here, let me, can I, okay, cool, you can use it from the back. Uh, can I hop? I think I can hop. Hop! Yes, we, we hopped successfully. Um, no, hold on, let's do the wall first. So it has support all the way across. And then we'll come back and break the uh, pieces on, like, the middle supports. So we're not gonna... We already have been um, having some questionable moments uh, performance-wise when we're getting to the edges. And it crashed once one of the times we were running down. But otherwise, stability is really good considering how much we've built. So uh, I'm just going to keep going until the game says we can't play anymore because it won't load. And if that happens, I'll be like the big sad, but like it's okay. We'll, we'll... Really? Here, here, it's okay. I might be special, but we have a little stair step. Uh, but if, if something happens to this world because uh, I built too many things and we just can't play in it anymore, uh, we'll, uh, we'll make a new save. We'll keep the character and we'll transfer as much as we can. And we'll just build less in one area. Because of how this game works, I love it. Uh, it'll unload your structures as you, like, go away. Uh, which, I mean, a lot of games do that anymore. Uh, which I appreciate. Uh, so you can fit more inside of a game. But, uh... There we go. Definitely, uh... We're just... We... We're a mad woman, and we're going to push the game until it cannot handle it anymore. So yeah, that's um, a, p a potential that could happen. We're hoping that it doesn't, but you must be prepared for the worst. Hope for the best, prepare for the worst. You've seen some hella dense builds, so you bet I'll be fine. Okay, okay. That's good, that's good. Um, we only get some very, very slight frame dropping when we run back into our base from the edge. Because I can show you right now, uh, literally like right over here. Boom. Uh, we get that frame spike because it's unloading a bunch of stuff on the other side of town. And as we run back in, our frames drop slightly because it's loading the stuff in. But it restabilizes after, like, a moment. Like, see? It's already stable again. Uh, but, yeah. 
And I even have it set to quality still. I could drop it down to performance if I needed to, which would um, just make the lights less cool, honestly. That's mostly what it does. Which I get it. Light mapping is so resource intensive. It's actually insane. Also, the dumbest thing, but one of one of my favorite little like fun facts that is actually kind of fun. Um, uh, fake lamps use real electricity, and it's just like, God damn it, it's true though. But I mean, like all all of the the light coming from your video game does. So it's like, well, yeah, no shit. Removes bloom. Uh, there is, I guess, yeah, that is the bloom, like the the fall off from the light uh oh yeah see i didn't know uh you could make the snow less uh blinding that's good to know because yeah uh if i pop into the settings and over to graphics we have we have bloom turned on i have i wait i have depth of field turned off oh i do hold on let me turn that back on i actually i really like that setting um Fallout 76 was another game that added depth of field, and it's like, I like it. It, it makes, I like focusing on, or like having that like more realistic focus. Depth of field actually was, and it was like, oh, that's really like immersive. Being a blind bitch that is nearsighted, it was very immersive. Hey, Shadow, how's it going? So, I have some news about the server, like, setting it up, the local server, um, the non-dedicated server. There's no, um, toggle setting on Xbox to make it cross-play, so I wonder if the cross-play only works, uh, if it's hosted from PC, which is... Big unfortunate, and because that's how it is with Space Engineers, and that's the only other game I know of that has Steam crossplay to console crossplay. Okay, I didn't look up any YouTube videos. I just did just look up basic information on the internet, and it was kind of outdated. So, uh, but I knew I saw some pictures of where it, it the crossplay toggle is on PC, and it's just not here there on console. So. It made me real sad. I uh, was gonna get that set up um, so you'd be able to get in here and start exploring, uh, but we'll get it figured out. I have not given up hope. I mean, hey, we all have to have a connection somewhere. Like, we, we can't know how to do everything, you know? We gotta, it's like, um, so the, wh this is one of the coolest things I ever heard, and it makes so much sense. The more people you know, the more collective knowledge you have. Like, it, not thinking of yourself as like a hive mind, but it's like, like if you know someone that knows how to program, well then, in your inner circle, essentially, you know how to program. Like, yeah, you yourself don't, but, um, oh, I'm like, what the hell just happened? Uh... And so, it's just a cool concept or, like, thought process of, like, yeah, the more people you know and the more people you have in your circle, the more collective knowledge you have. Which is why it's good to surround yourself with people that have a lot of differences, but also a lot of similarities. You gotta be able to vibe. Is that... Yeah, that's right. And then we'll line it up on the wall. Perfect. And we forgot to do this for the shelf below, but we're a special kid, okay? I forgot my foam helmet, everyone. It's alright. If it makes up for it, I have a headset with kitty ears. So, I think that might suffice. Because, yes, I'm that bitch. I have my Razor headset with my Razor kitty ears. 
No, that's not. That's not. That's, that's it. Speak for, for myself. You can do everything badly, but you can still do it. I mean, that's fair. There are jack of all trades or, um, whatever, whatever, uh, term you would prefer. That's the only, um, like, generalized skill set term that I know. Why can't it be like Nancy of all trades? Like, you know, why is it Jack? I like to make this joke. Um, one of my other uh, stupid jokes with this is, um, why is it like when you're joking? Why is it like, oh, I'm just joshing with you. Um, and uh, I'm just like, well, why can't, why can't I just be uh, like Jeremy with you, you know? Or, you know, it's just so stupid, but um, or it's like, let me be frank with you. It's like, no, let me be Rebecca with you. It's like, let's just change it up. I, I, I think it's silly, but it's fun. A Jacqueline of all trades. I love it. Oh my God. Yes. Oh, that's perfect. Fucking, uh, no, these shelves are for, uh, the black metal chests. This is the new warehouse. We have. I already put a couple over here for like reference of what they'll end up looking like. It's just, uh, so with the shelf like all the way out or the floor all the way out, it would have been out to this point and that would have been too much overhang and it would have been harder to access the top shelves. So that's why I set the, the shelf back for that specifically because it ends up being the perfect size for the chests and they'll, they'll slip in there even though it doesn't look like they do. Um, and yeah, we're gonna have oodles, canoodles, and toaster strudels of storage space. And I decided to do the center pillars so we can have signs in there and label all the chests. A jade of all trades. Ooh, that one works too. Chat's on fire tonight with the ideas. See, my brain just doesn't work with those kinds of ideas. I'm like the creative for like building, not like the creative for like, like thinking. I don't even know how to like word that. Clearly my brain does not work very well. Although, I think I think you 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 all know that by now. You you've been around for enough of the streams. And for anyone that hasn't, well, sorry. This is what you get. Um, it, it's just my personal flavor of airhead. I'm an indecisive, scatterbrained airhead. It's okay. We might tear down the same wall like four different times just to get it right, but. It's gonna get it done. Okay. We almost have this side done. It's exciting. We just gotta cap it off with... Wait, sorry, doing what now, Shadow? I don't even remember what I said, to be honest. I know I remember I said chat's on fire, and then I said some other things. Being an airhead. Scatterbrain. Indecisive scatterbrain. Oh, tearing down a wall. That's what. That's what, I bet. Yeah, see? Yeah, I got it. I got it right before you said it. Eventually, uh, sometimes I make it back. I hope you're proud of me, chat. Sometimes I'm not just a total complete airhead, just just most of the times. And if you're not proud of me, it's okay, I'm proud of me. Um How special could I be? I could have just done one of these. There we go. Okay. 
Um, and for the top here, I think I'll just cap it off and do that and we'll put little beamy boys an even tinier beamy boy all right yeah and that's yeah that's what we'll do oh let me hold on i don't feel right getting the rest of that done yet until i get this done but also uh sleep we must sleep always with the sleep Belheim. i wish i could make the days a bit uh longer I, okay, I like games that let you change like the time scale. So usually I like to make days uh, at least double as long and nights like half as long. Like Conan, I make days like three times as long, or um, or no, that's what it is. Days I make double long, and then I make nights three times as as fast to just fucking zip through. Don't get me wrong, there's a certain aesthetic to games at night, but I'm just big about like. I want a good good visual for everyone watching plus I want to be able to see what I'm doing easier so uh, definitely I, I try to sleep and get a, a more visually appealing or like easier to look at stream I might be an amateur but I have looked up a lot of things and picked up a lot of tips and tricks from people that have been very kind to um, give me some tips uh, and definitely I am a sponge for information I love it when people give me uh, suggestions and all that I try to incorporate it and if it doesn't work then I don't continue incorporating it uh, but there's been some things I've been getting better with my outros and stuff um, when I'm stupid tired because I stay streaming for too late and I didn't get enough sleep and then I worked also uh, then you know I stumble over my outros or uh, I did a co-op stream with my brother earlier uh, like hours earlier but um, also where the hell do I think I'm going definitely not the right way um, and I've not done a like a joint outro yet so we kind of stumbled through that, but it's okay. We're amateur streamers and we're still learning. But yeah, we played uh, Journey to the Savage Planet. I don't know if anyone here has played that, but very much fun. Gives in like uh, older game vibe. Something more like uh, along the lines of like Spyro or like Ratchet and Clank like almost like old story game like that where it had like different like stages or whatever you want to call them like different areas you could go to and a bunch of little like collectibles inside the areas and very drastic like biome changes and stuff from one area to another it's just stuff like that classic tropes it has very very funny uh, like satirical humor very very sarcastic like I'm I'm on board with it. Okay, I'm getting distracted. I don't I don't need to do that side yet. We need to do this. This little end cap. Um Yeah, let's do let's get the inside first. It makes it a little easier. Also, what am I doing? I'm supposed to do uh Oh, here. Wait, but how did I do it down here? Um. Oh, just not connected. Oh, okay. I made my life easy. Got it. Also. If only I could remember my own design. Okay. Except for that one. 
Wait, did I... No, okay, yeah. Okay. We're good. We're real, real good. Okay, yeah, so I don't even have to do those on the top one because of how the design's gonna be. Too bad we, uh, done did it down the entire freaking thing. Ah, uh, it's okay. Once again, the indecision coming into play. You know how much time we could save if I knew what I was doing? But I don't know a goddamn thing. Or as my my ancient Greek boy philosopher Socrates once put it uh, in a paradox of the only thing I know is that I know nothing. We love paradoxes. Contradictory statements are my favorite. It's very much not true, but also a little bit. I'll just leave everyone, like, guessing. Favorite quote is, you know nothing. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Are you saying that, or are you, like, mocking me, but, like, playfully? Because it's okay. I get it. Oh, there's a name? Oh, uh, okay. I don't think I'm familiar with that quote, specifically. I don't know very many quotes. Um, one of my other favorite quotes, uh, and this is because I have too much of an interest with like radiological things in general uh but robert uh, e oppenheimer with uh i am become death destroyer of worlds which the first place i ever heard that quote was an achievement name in um fallout 3 funnily enough the, the places i learn things they say video games don't teach you anything I was like, I was like 10 or something when I was playing Fallout and like in my life the word like mutilate had never really come up and so like it wasn't like a word that like I learned but it was kind of like something that more came into my vocabulary not like I used the word mutilate but like it was still just a word that came into my vocabulary because of that game or the word behemoth I had never seen it I didn't know how to pronounce it uh, I think the first time I saw it I was like like behemoth i'm just like i was so dumb i'm just like i don't under, i don't know and then i told my friend about it he's like oh yeah it's, it's called it's pronounced behemoth uh <laughs> uh yes yes the best quote i don't know many quotes lady road gaming 2024 <laughs> uh oh uh, you're saying a quote from Game of Thrones, the full quote is you know nothing, Jon Snow. Oh, okay. I feel like I've heard that, you know, on the internet. The interwebs. I do um, get around the interwebs. I am still kind of hip and with it, with the kids. I say this kind of facetiously because I'm only 25. Even though, uh, when people see me, they always guess. They're like, oh, I don't know, like, 19? I think the last time someone guessed my age, they guessed me at, uh, 21. I'm like, oh, you're getting closer. Which, I mean, it's, I guess it's flattering, but it's like, I don't know. It's just like, well, it is what it is. It's not even annoying or, like, slight, like, not even, like, mildly annoying. Just, like, it's one of those things, like, I've just come to expect it at this point or um i think uh 
what is it? One of Mark Twain's quotes was, um, uh, what is it? Don't take, or don't, what is it? Don't take the, no, what is it? Take the, the path less traveled. No, it's, it's something, um, don't take the path traveled instead, leave a trail or some shit like that. I'm pretty sure it was a Mark Twain quote. Uh, your favorite Game of Thrones quote is Bronn saying about an impregnable fortress. Give me ten good men and some climbing spikes. I'll impregnate the bitch. Oh my god. With that show, I'm not surprised. I never watched it, but like, uh... I don't intend to, just cause like, I heard that the, what was it, the last three seasons were trash? Or the last two? I don't know. I'm not trying to like, insult what was good of the show. I just know from the community that like, they just totally dropped the ball because of like, being, the, the directors being offered like a project with Disney or something like that, and so they rushed through the rest of Game of Thrones or something, something, I don't know, it's just like, third hand information. I was told by someone that was told by someone. It's like... Hold on. That's what it is. Um, it's Ralph Waldo Emerson. Do not go where the path may lead. Go instead where there is no path and leave a trail. That was the quote I was personally thinking of. I don't know why I thought it was Mark Twain. Because I'm dumb and I don't know who, who makes quotes. Or who decides that these people make quotes, I, I guess, is the real, like, standpoint. Okay, let's get these little pieces. So we got our crusty crab pizza. I don't know why, that just popped in my head. So now I'm sharing with all of you. Enjoy. This is a tedious process, everyone. But as with everything I do, it's well worth it. And I'll be satisfied once it's done, because we'll be able to store everything in the storage room. The reason why uh, I'm finally getting on this is because we, we ran out of space to store boar scraps and resin. So I'm like, okay, now we're out of space for two things. We gotta, we gotta move on this. It's become not just something we need to do, but it's a priority now. It's like first class priority mail. Enjoy the random, like, thought branches that my brain takes me down. Is there... No, there's not one back there. Can I... What? What's going on? Did... Did I place it? Are those sticking out of the wall? No. Game, why are you gaslighting me? Okay, hold on. Let's just, uh... Let's remove that one. And then, uh... Oh, thanks, Hammer. It's okay. There, okay. It just wanted to gaslight me and not let me snap it there. But it lets me do that one. You know what? Whatever. You know what matters is that it let us put it there. Eventually. I guess the back one really doesn't even matter. I'm not going to see it, but you know what? I'll know.
All right, you know what? It doesn't it doesn't bo bother me that much for that one. I might forget. Can I at least just get this one in though? Thank you. That is that was absolutely a skill issue, everyone. Just need that to be known. We have those quite often. Also, how'd that happen? How's it like slightly offset? I don't care enough to try to really figure it out, but like, huh. Peculiar. Oh well. Doesn't matter. Did we finish the top? I don't think I did. I, I guess I did, okay. Also, putting these chests in here are gonna be a bitch. Is that, it's not done. Snap. Up there. And then. We're almost done with this side, everyone. This struggle is real tonight. Oh my gosh. Okay. We did it. We're done with that side. And now we have this side. Um, oh. And then I need uh, the log. The small log, there we go. Did it, I did them sideways, right? Yeah. Now, is that correct? It's like... Okay. It looks taller on this side. And there's only one real way to find out. Here, actually, let's be smart, everybody. I can be smart now and again. On occasion. It looks right. Is it actually lined up that I can just like slap this on here? That's like actually crazy. I didn't think that was going to line up. Put that like in the Guinness Book of World Records, like, as in like, coolest Valheim moment for this stream. No, <laughs> be one of those stupid, very, like, specific records, like, did a triple backflip somersault into a kiddie pool, specifically in Alabama on a Tuesday of, like, February, like, I don't know, like, 7th. Some stupid shit, you know. I don't even know, actually, so no. You probably don't either. Wait, what? The hell? The hell am I looking at? How? How? What is that snapping to? Explain, game. Hold on. What could you have possibly snapped to? Oh, do the... Oh, because it's the halfway point. Okay, okay. I'm like, those don't have like... Four snap points, or five snap points, but um... They do have three snap points. It's at the bottom. Wait. 
No, they don't have a middle snap point. Okay, game, what the fuck are you on then? What are you snapping to? Uh Oh, I'm dumb. There's a wood iron beam in the the post. Jesus Christ. I should hold an award show for myself where I commemorate my best moments. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, maybe if I was more full of myself. I used to be. I, I've gotten better about it. It was that it was there was a turning point in my life. Um, I mean, you know, coming out really helped me, like, realize a lot about myself, but, um, uh, that was a huge turning point, but, uh, that, that, that's specifically beside the point, um, for this. It, it just, uh, after I realized my biggest turning point was like, oh, I used to think I'm smart, but I'm really dumb. I'm just like, yeah. You're stupid. I'm just like, life has gotten a lot easier. Because then when something happens that might be embarrassing, because it's like, to a smart person, I mean to say, I can just be like, oh, well, I'm an airhead, or oh, I'm just dumb. Like, sorry. I was like, what are they going to do? Call me stupid? I just did. Like, you can't insult me if I'm already insulting myself. And I think that's why I've leaned into, like, the self-depreciating humor, which I'm not a huge fan of. Like, it's definitely not, like, I don't say any of this stuff seriously. And I know for some people, like, it actually bothers them. But for me, it's like, I don't, it's not even, like, a coping mechanism for pain. It's just the kind of thing of, like, I don't know. It's like, if I say it, someone might find it funny. It's also, like, kind of just a habit. And it's like, when I call myself stupid, I don't mean, like, I am, like, as dumb as, like, a bag of rocks or, like, have a soft spot on my head or something. But, like, uh, I don't know. I'm pretty special at times, though. And there are even more moments every day that I'm just like, yeah, yep, yep, there's no denying it. I'm an airhead. You've all seen my streams, too. I already knew I was an airhead before that, but I was just like, dear lord, I'll be talking about something, and then I'll forget what I was saying, or I'll start saying something else mid-topic, mid, mid -topic, cause it's like, oh, well, hold on, I gotta explain this, like, subtopic of this topic, and then I never get back to the main topic, because I describe too much on the subtopic, I forget the main topic. Or I get to talking so much I forget what I'm doing in the game and that happens a lot. And then I wander for a few minutes and then I'm like, wait, what the hell am I doing? I was doing something. Okay. Whew. Give me just a moment to stretch. Oof. Okay. Ah. I need to get better about sitting up straight. Have good posture, everyone. Hydrate and tell your mom you love her, unless you can't, or your your mother's toxic like mine and you don't talk to her. So you used to stream and you'd find yourself walking in circles, doing and saying nothing because your brain broke. <laughs> I mean, I get that. No, literally, um, so, like, there will be sometimes, uh, like, my friend and I have played Minecraft, like, all day, and then we're, like, we don't feel like playing another game, but we're still just chatting, so then we end up just running around in circles, uh, just talking. And, like, just keep running around in the same circles, going through the same loops. And then sometimes I'll, like, run off, go do something, and then go back to running in circles. And it's just like, yeah, I try not to do that on stream. Because people like to see stuff happen. But also, like, a lot of the times, uh, that's fortunately not an issue. Uh, because I'm so focused on building. My problem is sometimes I forget to talk. Or I literally uh, have had like so many times where I've had trouble thinking of something to talk about that it just I'm just like um yeah so 
how's the weather? And obviously, I'm not gonna fucking do that on a stream, but like, <laughs> I guess I could, but, uh, so how's the weather, everyone? No. <laughs> uh, I love to make fun of myself sometimes. It's fun. Like, if you can't make fun of yourself and make light of some of your, like, silliness, then it's like, I don't know. It's not gonna enjoy life. And I spend enough of my my days and time depressed, so I try to be as happy and positive of a person as I can. It's not easy, trust me. It's not easy, but it's a lot. Uh, it feels a lot better being a nice, positive person than it does being a fucking negative Nancy. Oh damn, I'm special here. I don't feel like breaking the wall again. Okay, that suffices. Sorry, yeah, oh, negative Nathan. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, so let's go fancy with it. A negative Nathaniel. I mean, if we're gonna, we might as well be extra and I am very much extra with a lot of the things I do. But that's my charm, everyone. Being extra. I, I'm just so quirky. I'm different. No, I'm joking. <laughs> or am I? No. <laughs> I'll, leave, I'll, I'll leave you to ponder on that. Okay. Try to get this done quick. <sighs> Got the the yawnies. We we can't be yawning now, can we? Hey, at least there's Debbie Downer. I mean, uh. Or there could be Daniel Downer, or, um, what's another D name besides Derek? Um, Dakota, D Dakota Downer. No, I mean, Derek would work, it's two syllables. David Downer, there we go, David Downer, that's the one. I love it. I love it. Thank you for indulging my silliness. So, okay, so while we're on the stupid, silly uh, subjects, uh, you two might appreciate my dumb joke. So I was at work the other night. I mean, this was like a few few months ago. Um, it, when I say the other night, it's an arbitrary amount of time, as with, like, I think most other people. But um, I was at work, and... Uh, uh, well, I don't remember how I led it, led with it, but I was just like, so you know the the rapper the baby, right? And then uh, my coworker was just like, yeah, yeah. Uh, they're they're like, uh, I'm just like, you don't even have to be familiar with his music. You just have to know of him. He's like, oh, okay, okay. I'm like, good, because I don't know his music either. Um, but I'm just like, how how long do you reckon it'll be before he's like? the kid and he the look he gave me was just like shut the fuck up and get away from me and i, and I just started busting up laughing because i'm i'm so dumb but i just thought it was so funny and i've been i've been saving that one i haven't told that on stream yet so what what did i do How do I... How did I... Okay, you know what? Fuck it. We'll just do it exactly like we just did it a minute ago. Thank you, Bryco. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh, you think you fixed your walls? Nice, nice, nice. It's what we like to hear, Shadow. When it comes to survival games, I am a fan of walls.
Walls keep you safe. Such a convoluted way to do it, but, um... It works, you know? I can't complain, because there's a way to get it done. How long till it breaks? What? What? How have you gained support back from me placing things on you? That doesn't make sense, Valheim. Just fucking break. I was being a smartass with the extra beams. What the hell? I swear, when I need it to stay for just a little bit, it's like, nah, I'm gonna instantly break. I can't handle the pressure. But then there, it's just like, eh, eh, I'm gonna chill, fuck you. You can't tell me how to live my life. Um, diddly dumb. Okay, yeah. Shabam. And then, bam! It's amazing. Yep, and that's how we we do it. You're learning Hotmail so you can fix a Valheim sign guide you're making, but you gotta watch some videos. Okay, well thank you for popping in, Bryco. I really do appreciate it. You're always welcome on the streams. It is fixed. Oh, amazing, Shadow. I cannot wait to see it. But yeah, Bryco, I hope you have a great night. And good luck with the learning. I'm like, no? Okay. Alright. You know what? Alright. You know what? We're gonna try it one more time. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's the money right there. Can I get the angle? Oh, I have a coin. Oh. There we go. It might help if I wasn't being dumb. But that, that, it's not gonna happen. I have two brain cells, one of which usually does not work unless my brain goes into overdrive. All right, we're, we're getting there. I want to say we're almost there, but we're not. Now you gotta fix the floor with scaffolding on it. Ooh, uh... Ooh, good luck. Good luck, my friend. I have faith in you, but good luck. Break that floor. Yeah. Yes, brain. This is right. What? What's the matter? I don't know why I was like looking around like something was wrong. It just felt like something was wrong about it. I'm like, all right, let me look at the other side. Brain does not work. 
It's okay. Um, I, yeah, I need to use the bathroom real quick. Um, I'm gonna run to the tavern. Doodly -doo 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 -doo. But yeah, Shadow, I'm wondering if, with how console hosting works, if I had, like, an actual, like, server, it would probably easily be able to be cross-play, but, because it'd be through, like, a server hosting, but since it would be, like, a non-dedicated through an, the Xbox, I imagine that might be why cross-play can't be enabled, but uh, everything I've looked up says that there is cross-play from Xbox to Steam. It's not like it's, like, um... I don't remember what game it was that has crossplay on Steam, but it's only with like Epic, and then console has crossplay with like just console. But I know you said you have a friend; you'll you'll get it figured out. But it was just random thought that popped in my brain. I'm like, eh, I'm gonna go and share that. It's the whole like point of like streaming. I I feel like I I got that concept like. I don't know, a hundred hours ago, stream-wise, and was just like, yeah, I need to just start just spouting these these random, like, ideas and things that pop in my head and just start talking about it. That's what people want to hear. Let, let people, like, learn me as a person, because I'm trying to, like, get people to like my personality more than, like, oh, come, come back for Valheim, because eventually it's not going to be Valheim. It'll be a different survival builder. But we'll, we'll, we'll always be back to Valheim. I love this game, but... I'll be right back. I gotta get a drink and use the bathroom. Okay, I have returned. Thank you for bearing with me, everyone.
Okay. We have a lot of things we need to do, everyone. But for now, we're just gonna continue building. Okay. Yeah, because we still have another shelf to put in. The tedious part is fixing the floors. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, Shadow. I get it. Having to, like, go back and redo anything in this game, it's worth it, but oh my god. So sometimes, it's just like, ugh. I can't, like, mentally, I just can't sometimes. And then that's when we go and, like, loot, like, a crypt or something, or, like, break a rock, because it's like, uh, I love building, but sometimes I just, I need a break from it, which, it makes sense. Too much of a good thing is not, you need moderation. Except for cocaine. No, I'm joking. Do not do cocaine, everyone. It's bad for you. Believe it or not. Contrary to popular belief. No, I'm joking. Okay, cool, yo. Fun fact, we had a president that, president that did meth. Which president was that? <laughs> I'm curious. Turns out it was like fucking... I don't even know. I don't know very many presidents. I'm not... Not very smart. Okay. Ooh, is Roosevelt? Oh no. Man did some shit then. get a corner meth for his headaches oh well was it like like lab th synthesized like like methadone or some shit like that so it wasn't just like methamphetamines like or whatever I don't know like there there's a lot of medicines, even, well, for modern times now at least, that have, like, meth in part of the name because it has some of the properties, but it's, like, synthesized differently, so it doesn't, like, affect you in the same way. But, I mean, yeah, that makes sense if, like, let's say he had, like, a deprivation of oxygen or something, and, like, it, like, um, dilated his, like, blood vessels or something, that would definitely help with... A headache. And I mean, Adderall is essentially a clean version of, like, amphetamines, too. And so, just as another example of, of medicine. Another interesting fact, he was high during his speech after the bombing of Pearl Harbor. Oh, interesting. Oh, okay. It was actual methamphetamine. Well, you know, it, it was different times back then. You know, they, they were just they were just goofing around, just a couple of of goobers. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't fucking know. But I stand by what I said. I'm gonna question it, but I'll stand by it. It's okay. 
So, the question is, everyone, what should we do uh, after... After we're done building the shelves, um, we could either go straight to getting black metal scrap, or alternatively, I do need to get some gray dwarf eyes, so we could do that first. The CIA gave LSD to normal people as a test. Oh, well, yeah, yeah. That was part of, um. Oh, fuck. Uh. God damn it. I don't remember what it was called. But yeah, no, I, I'm familiar with all of that. Well, not like super familiar, but like I've heard of it at the very least. And like heard it in detail, but I don't remember it. That's how I'm trying to say it. They wanted a drug to give prisoners for a truth serum. Yeah, yeah, no, they tried all kinds of shit in like the 50s and 60s. Like, it's terrifying. Ah. For someone who never done any type of drugs, knows a lot of drug facts. Well, I mean, you know knowledge gets around to certain people and drug use doesn't always necessarily uh, imply drug knowledge just want to be done this is one of those things where it's like satisfying but I put too much detail into it so now it's taking too long and now I just like want to be done but it's one of those things that like I don't want to take a break from it because we got it just we got to just like slog through and just get it done those there and then again we're gonna do what we been doing wait do I have tar on me oh hey Do 
do that, and then... Regular beam, and half beam. And then other half beam. All right. Okay, yeah, nothing else got stuck up in the the X's. Just wanted to make sure. Oh, wait, 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 wait. For an airhead, I sure do be remembering some things tonight. It's crazy. Like, actually insane. Quite zany, one might say. No one would say that. I would, actually. And if you would say something zany, or if you would say zany too, call 1-800-ZANY. Just to say how zany you are. No, I'm joking. <laughs> that might be a number. Probably not. It's not the right amount of, uh... Digits. Huh? Wait... What? Is that, is that how I did it? Yeah, okay. We're good, we're good, we're good. The real, the special hit real hard. Okay, let's go. All right, you know what, whatever. No! You think I know how to play this fucking game <laughs> with as much as I've played it, but... Dear Lord, clearly I don't know how to play. Okay. Swear. I'm about to just like say fuck it, we'll come back to this later. But we're so close, I'd like to just finish it. It's just if I bounce my leg anymore, I'm gonna fucking start shaking the floor. No, I'm joking. <sighs> I usually bounce my leg when I get impatient. <laughs> For some people, it's like a nervous trait, which don't get me wrong, uh, it's kind of a nervous trait at times, but usually bounce my leg when I start to get impatient because I just want to get something done. It's like, let's fucking go. Also, I just did that the, the dumb way. I could have done that like this. Uh, da 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 Oh, here. I'm like, where's the closest little beam? Eeny teeny weeny little beam. Oh. Alright, we're down here now. Also, we don't need that. We need that. I, it, game, excuse you. Come on, I was looking at that and I copied. Thank you. Just so rude. Yeah, I think, I think I decided after we, um, we finish up these shelves, I'll go get the Great Dwarf eyes. Like, 
what am I doing? What am I figuring out? Good God. There. It's not done, though. Okay, let's just... Right, right, okay. So, we need to go sleep, and then we'll be back to um, finish that. starting to get dark in there and I don't have the lanterns I need to get more chains that that needs to be something we do fairly soon uh where'd that stone come from Did it just take forever to like move up? Cause we did fix these bricks at one point and that would be where that stone came from. Also a rarity, the, the tavern fire pit going out. Hey, you're finished with the floor. Nice, nice. Nothing like finishing a project, or a part of a project, I mean to say. Especially if it was a really tedious part. Okay. Day 400. Just wait for day 420. Oh, yeah. No, I'm joking. do like Rimworld and consume some smoke leaf as they call it okay let's get the support beams Ever so slowly, but surely we're getting it done. Oh no, and then we're breaking shit. That was a misclick, everyone. Misclick. If anyone gets that reference, I know it's a little, little, little older at this point now. I'm not gonna explain the reference or where it came from. If you know, you know. Come on. I am do have the big struggle. And if that didn't make sense, well, then you clearly don't speak Unga Bunga like I do.
I see, I just had to cycle once. Instead, I went all the way through. The other way. It's okay. We like doing extra work. Okay. So now I gotta, oh, hold on. That one. Now I gotta come through with... Damn it. Yeah. Yeah. I gotta get that one. I do believe I've fallen into a pickle. Here we go. This might be a hot take, but pickles, kind of gross. But that's my opinion. I don't know what it is. I just don't like how they taste. Yeah, you know, whatever. We'll fix that in a moment. Also, maybe a hot take? Chocolate milk? Kinda garbage. <laughs> and I, I mean that. Same with chocolate pudding and ice cream. I don't vibe. I vibe with like, chocolate cake and like, cupcakes. Like brownies, like chocolate, you know, like actual, like chocolate. Oh my god, okay, we're almost done. No. Yep, okay. Excelente. Muy caliente. Okay, let me go through and see if I miss anything. Yeah, indeed I did. And that's why we're going back through. Oh my god. Did I? No. Can I? Thank you, game. I'm like, what the hell? Dear lord. I don't even know if that was, like, the game or just me. Like, you know, if you've been around long enough, you know I'm more than apt to admit it's a skill issue. But like that, I genuinely just don't know if that was me or the game. It might be because there's so many different like snap points in one spot. It's just like, uh, what the fuck do you want me to do? And I'm like, the thing, obviously. Done, and then we can go kill some things, which will be a, a good relief from all this this stress I have from doing this shit that I don't want to do. <sighs> I was enjoying it at first, but then it's just like so tedious. It's like when you've been at work for like an hour, but it feels like you've been there for three, and then you look at the time, and it's like fuck. 
That's kind of like how it felt like doing this. Okay. I... Yep, nope, I didn't. Well... When you're scheduled for 10 hours and it feels like you've been there from daylight to sunset. No, literally, literally, I get that. Fucking, it feels like, it's like, oh, I woke up and then you're just going to work. And then it's just like, by the time you're getting off, it's like, fuck, I, I need to just like go to sleep. But like, I can't usually. So then I end up super, staying up super late. Um, for me, because I work night shifts specifically or like evening into nights. But, um, but yeah, no, fucking, I get that. It was like your entire day is just gone. Okay. Dear Lord. Big stretch. Oh. I need to go get more cloud berries too. But we can do that after we do the Grey Dwarf murder. Because I would like to get a portal in here. Oh, so you know how I said it was, wasn't going to bother me? Well, it bothers me. That little pole is not in place. So I, I don't feel like breaking the chest and just doing it the smart way. Oh, plus there's a little floor in there, too. Oh, whoops. Well, I guess it's a good thing I broke that open then, huh? I mean, I totally knew that was there. I meant to break that, yes. Oh, hey. We're not done. Whoops. God damn it, we're not done. I'm a goddamn fool. I was so excited to be done. I know I just checked over this side. Okay, uh... Yeah, let's... Fucking do the thing I said I was gonna do. God damn it. Okay, everything in there. Let's go repair the stuff. I don't need armor for this. If I wasn't on passive, I would... I'd probably always have my armor on if I wasn't on passive mode. Okay, and then, not that I'll probably need it, but let's repair the hammer. And then down to the portals we go. Okay. 
No, I still have three more minutes before I need to eat. I'll go and wait. Um, it should be resource portal. Or resource location. Yeah, there it is. the next tedious part the roof oh yes yeah oh especially with the uh... <sighs> getting all like the joists in or whatever on the ceiling like the beams and shit no my loot it's rolling away we can't allow that my rock where do you think you're going, little rock? Come back here. Damn, I need to just build a wall, like, around the perimeter. So then these fuckers can't wander out. I would uh, dig it down into the ground, but there's water, so that won't work. I'll have to find a better spawner. Okay. And honestly, I don't even need to do full walls. We can just do the half walls. Oh, right, right. I totally knew that. First is putting up the joist, then you put the roof tiles. Ah, okay. See, I'm always super paranoid about it raining on my sh wooden shit, and so I get the roofs in as quickly as possible. Can I raise this up? No, you cannot. 
And before I accidentally break it, we're gonna stop messing around with that. We'll have to, I'll have to test with that in a different world. I wonder if you can completely um, submerge it into the ground or like completely cover it into the ground and have them spawn and because of how the spawning works it would push them up top and keep this completely protected from accidental hits because that's my biggest fear is accidentally breaking it. Okay, yeah, that should be the right spacing. Okay. Get the ones outside fucking cleaned up. But yeah, um, if I could get it so they could spawn and I could just smack them. Which again, if I could lower the ground, that's one way to do it. But there's water, so I can't really. It won't work very well. But we already have enough for the portal that we need to make I do want to get at least enough for a full set so just uh what I have 24 well, 27 so it's 340 23 more but yeah if I if the game will let me completely like raise the ground and not have that break and they'll spawn and spawn up onto the ground then I'll raise a bunch of the ground around here and and just do that and then pen them in so that way it's easier to just murder them ooh a shaman you give me eyes still right? yeah it's the brutes and the regular ones that don't. Okay, we're almost there. Speaking of a brute. Maybe it'll give me a head. Give me a brute head. I think I saw one. No, but it dropped flowers. Okay. I don't need the Grey Dwarf trophies. I need the, the brute trophy. If you put four of those... So if you take, like, the item stand, uh, the wall item stand, specifically, and um, you put the, like, where the arrows are going or where it has, like, the little peg off the side. If you put that toward the center and then you do three more, like, 90 degrees from each other, uh, you can make, like, a little flower pot. And if you put three of the brute uh, dwarf heads, or brute dwarf, the gray dwarf brute heads or um, three turnips in there, you can get, um, like, a little flower pot. It's a little trick I picked up from the community. So I will take 0% credit for that idea. I just have been trying to pass it along because I think it's so fucking cool. Okay, yeah, that's the eyeballs we need. Okay. Yeah, I'd definitely like to find a better spawner spot and or I need to test and see if I could just lift the ground. Oh look, there's my pet deer. 
little buddy just likes to to chill. I wish you could put a certling core in a campfire and just keep it burning forever. I get why you can't, but like, come on guys, please. <laughs> Alrighty. We slept in our bed for once. Was that two nights in a row that we slept in the house? That's actually crazy. I usually run up to the tavern. Um, we have the eyes. I don't have the cores on me, so let's run up to... Come on. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, I don't have a little... Oh, wait. What am I talking about? There's literally a staircase right here. Uh, how special could one girl be? Pretty damn fucking special, everyone. Now, what the hell was I coming up here for? Um... No, uh... Something in the warehouse. Uh, cores. Oh, my. oh my. Oh, dear lord. Yeah. Okay. Um. Where does this one lead? I'm thinking. I think this is... Oh, is this in the Yagloth Plains, or is this in the first plains we found? This is Yagloth, okay. So... Uh... Do, 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 do. Yeah, that's fine. This one can stay. We'll just, uh, remove the one... Oh my god. So I could have just... I didn't even... You know what, never mind. We have a set of eyes for portals in the future. And that's okay. Okay, um, the craniums in here, and do I have brute heads? Uh, I didn't see it, hold on. Not in there. I don't, oh, I don't. Oh, thought I had one. I'll have to get some. For multiple reasons. Oh well, it'll be easy enough once I can farm the the dwarfs up, or the gray dwarfs up easier. Jesus, I have too much resin. I forget that the gray dwarfs drop resin. I don't really use that much resin though because I don't have any like standing torches or anything. I'm not a fan of having to refuel light sources. Also, why the hell can we not put a dandelion on an item stand? What, what, why game? Why? What logic is that? I gotta put these berries up. Or I guess I should call them parries since they're buke parries. I love it. It's silly. Uh, was it this bottom one? No, uh...
Wait, what? Did I just like... Oh, there they are. Okay. Um... Seeds go up here, actually. Tree seeds, still. There's so much I need to do still. It's okay. We're getting there, everyone. Very slowly, but also surely. Dandelions were up top, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Kind of useless, honestly. Okay, let's go over to the storage room and build the freaking portal, everyone. Okay. Damn it. Hold on. Okay, it's perfect. Okay, there we go. Shabamski? Yeah, okay. I love it. It's perfect. It was gonna bug me that it wasn't, like, centered front to back, so that's why we fixed it. If you take care of the issues before they become a real issue, then, you know, you don't have issues. It's kind of, like, actually, like, mind-boggling how that works, everyone. <laughs> I say very facetiously. All right, let's go get more scrap metal, which means we need to don our armor. Because we're gonna be slapping around some fullings and some of them are gonna be brutes. And the fullings will be fine, but the brutes, they hurt. They hurt just a little bit, everyone. Also, let me get... Uh, my keyboard and mouse plugged in. It's a lot easier to do this part with it. Wait, those are the greaves, yeah. Okay. Boom. Um, yeah, we've got our armor. We have our sword. Not that we need to, but we're... Ooh, we will repair everything. Blah, 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 blah. I can't speak sometimes. Did I... Yeah, those are upgraded to where they can go for now. Okay, um, let me restock on my bolts. Come on. There we go. When it, like, technically opens the chest. Because, like, look, from here it says open chest, but if I press it, there's no chest menu. Like, you can't access the inventory, and it doesn't actually open the container. That's funny. But, like, it's like I just pressed, like, my inventory button, essentially. But that's not what I was doing, so. Um, and also, yeah, we needed more cloud berries, so it's perfect timing. 
I love this armor though because it very much reminds me of like uh especially with the cape it's very much like the Dark Souls 2 like armor but it's almost like a mix of uh the like classic blue knight armor which would be the Dark Souls 1 armor that they did bring into uh 2 and 3 but um was not the the like iconic armor for those games Two is the like has like some animal furs and armor on it, um, and then three was the I think it was like the Firelink Guardian or whatever um, armor was the iconic armor on the cover. Which don't get me wrong, it's cool, but my personal favorite set of armor from Dark Souls three was the dancer's armor, at least for the boss armor. There was other cool like armor and stuff. Where am I going? I know to the plains, but, um, oh, the Yagloth portal, specifically. So there is not as many camps that way, and so we wanted to take those out and then go back to the other plains and start working on that. There we go. My brain's getting back with it. I was starting to get some brain grog there, everyone, because, fuck it, I just, ugh, I needed those shelves to be done. And yeah, we have stuff here. We can... Oh, did I steal the cart? Damn, I stole the cart and I took it down south. Um, oh, wait. It's literally over there. No, yeah. Let's just run over there. I was going to go back through the portal and then go to it. Um, but hey, look, there's a there's a little, little green dude on the way. Let's put the sword away. Alright, Shadow. Thank you so much for popping in and chatting. I really do appreciate it. I always look forward to you hopping in the streams. And I really wanted to get it set up so you'd be able to hop in the world at any point. But we got I got to get that figured out still, so... We'll get there. Alright, let's bring this cart over to this little village. And let's start fucking up their shit. Uh, I will be streaming again tomorrow night for the scheduled stream. Tonight was the bonus stream. And hopefully tomorrow after you get more of the new base done. You can take me on the Grand Tour. I am very much looking forward to it. I liked what you had going on there before. Oh, you know what I should do to break this? Where's a brute? It's a big, ugly brute. Oh, do they... Alright. Maybe the brutes don't respawn. That, w that makes sense. We could always aggro a locks and get them to destroy the village. I don't even see any lockses. I did just like a little bit ago. I think when I was running over here, I saw some. I'm just like looking off in the distance for one. I mean, they're not slow. I could get one to follow me. We're also not, like, specifically here for breaking their shit, but I'm also down with it. Oh, there's one. Let's get its attention. Hey, come here. There's a pretty cool tower that you should break. No, no, no. You got a slam. Big slam. Yeah.
Um, let's see. Come over to the building. Yeah, there you go. You have the idea. Here, I'll stand by the edge so it's easier for you to pathfind. Can you... Are you having trouble? Can you slam down? Here, let me, let me just shove inside of you. No, it's having trouble. Let me, let me come outside. There we go. Come on, buddy. You can do it. Just a big slam down right here. Yeah. And then one more of those, and I think we got this. Well, I meant like a slam, but... There we go. Nah, I can get that one myself. Thanks for like waiting for me to use my power. I really do appreciate that. I gotta be careful. Because I have stamina foods prepped. I don't have a balanced food plus uh, health food and stamina food. Also, I didn't think about it. Can you, yeah, take out this hut. Oh, there's stuff in there. Nice. Just go ahead and slam down. Taking too long, damn it. We'll just chop it up. Cause like, some of this stuff I can break with a hammer, but most of it I can't. Yeah, like none of that stuff. But then they have like, uh, little logs around that you can break. Okay, let's start. Oh, hey, my cart got messed up and all of that. Not surprising. There we go. Okay, let's start getting stuff in here. stuff this way Give me your metal.
One more hit. Nope. Now one more hit. Okay. I love that these little green people drop so much loot. So much shit to be had. I absolutely love it. I am a fan of stuff and things. Even though I know we're loading up on a bunch of shit that's not metal we still want the stuff because I'm a hoarder so yeah I don't do I don't really like having a whole lot of material objects in real life but uh, in video games I want to have everything I like collecting things. Oh no! Did not mean to disconnect from the cart. Once we get this, the rest of the stuff broke down and have it collected in the cart, uh, we're gonna take what we can back and then sleep as well. There we go. Again, not that I need it, but hey, free deer hide. I'm not worried about breaking every last thing. We will break this, though. Okay, I think after we grab whatever the hell that is, some logs, we'll head back to the portal. Also, what is that, that light? Is that just on the portal? Or not the portal, but is that just on the platform? I didn't remember there being a light there. And how'd that not get destroyed during the boss fight? How'd I not notice that before though? Maybe I can just level the ground from here. Just 
stone. There's a rock. Where'd it go? There it is. I'm like, I saw one, but then the grass comes back in, and so it's hard to see as you get closer. There, now we can pull it up here a lot easier. I'm not a fan of struggling most of the time. It depends. Mostly on my mood. Oh, right, um, because we never named the one down in the new storage. Ho hopefully, this connects. Dang, um... How did we get here? Oh, no, we took the portal from, uh... Well, shit. Okay, um... We gotta make a short jaunt to the north, everyone. Oh, man. I did not remember that that portal wasn't connected, so... Slight inconvenience. Also, I still have a tar pit here. That's great. Uh, I should very much um, mark that. How do I... Oh, well, yeah, I would just select it. Um... How do I add a pin? Oh. Wait, what? No, I'm dumb. Oh, oh, there we go. I'm like, it's not working. I'm trying to learn how to add a pin with a mouse. Uh, tar pit. I should have just done it with the controller, though. I don't know how to use keyboard and mouse, so. Not with this game. I say that. I know, like, a lot of the controls, but then my brain just doesn't want to, like, absorb it or, like, store it. And it's because I learned it with a controller. Oh, yeah, we need... Berries. I forgot about that. Because we've been eating so many of them. Okay. Little skella boy just chilling. Oh, so there's a shipwreck here. I don't know if there's treasure with them usually, but I never really mined around that one, so I don't know if it's, like, buried in the ground or if there was just no loot with it. Might be one of those structures, just no loot. Okay, so let me go through this portal real quick. Let me go name the storage room portal. Or, uh, whew. oh gosh, uh, the warehouse. I don't. I always call it the storage room, but it's a warehouse. Oh yeah, those neck tails that I never picked up, and I'm not gonna pick up right now because I'm not running back to the tavern. Hey buddies.
Yeah, see, it's linked. Which is why I couldn't link to it with it unnamed. Okay, there we go. Storage. So then when I'm out on the field and I have teleporters I just want to throw down, I can name it storage and come right back to the storage room and put everything up. Even though I know I don't have the, the black metal for everything yet, so... Um, really what I should be doing... Did I ever take the portal down up here? Or what is it linked to? I think... Oh, no, it's still linked to the, the Mistlands. Isn't it? Copper, yeah. Um, okay, sorry, sorry. We're getting so distracted. Let me Let me put up what I can. Um, locks, and then I've got some needles, a head, oops, and it was the wrong one anyway. Wait, no, these go in the first one? Oh, they do, okay. And then I can leave rock in here. Rock and stone. Put core wood in there. No, sorry, core wood in, in there. Go put the is that barley? Yeah, let's go put the barley in here. Oh, there's too much barley. Oh no. No, I'm joking. Uh that's fine. We'll just put it down here. Ouch. Okay, and then over to the tavern. Well, here, since we're going to the tavern. Let's get those neck tails. Not like we need them for crafting, but they're on the ground, so... We just... We might as well. It seems silly not to, because, like... I mean, we could just recycle them, but we don't need to. We don't have so many that it's like, alright, we're drowning in necktails. We're just gonna start <sighs> cooking them and letting them burn to turn into charcoal. Because at that point, that's all they're useful for. Okay. Let's go back. Um, in a moment, actually. Sorry. I need fine wood. I know I don't have any up there. Do I have 40 fine wood in here? I do. I know future me will not be happy about this, but fuck that bitch. She can deal with it. I'm not dealing with it right now. I got other things that I'm dealing with. As will she, but, you know, future me can deal with it. And then the cores. Four cores. And then... Da -da 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 -da, eyeballs. And no, I have... It's only ten eyes per portal, right? Yeah, so I have two sets of portals. Nice. I forgot how to count. Okay, well, um... Actually, just put it over here, because that would make more sense. Let's just name it Metal. Because we're going to be taking... Uh, black metal scrap through here. We need to keep getting it, it's, or keep it smelting. Okay, let's, uh, run back now. So we can go back through the Yagloth portal. 
and then just instantly transport the materials to where we need to go. Yeah. Damn. Okay, fine. I do this every time. Just use the stairs like a normal person. But I'm not normal, damn it. I'm what they call neurospicy. Okay. We're gonna get the metal back real quick. I might need to, uh, well, no, I'm gonna wait, actually. Um, I was gonna say, I might need to get, uh, a second blast furnace made. Uh, actually, that kind of stands. What does it take? Don't have the fine wood up here. I don't think. I mean, I don't think, but I don't think we have fine wood up here specifically. Okay, let's go. I don't think I have any more fine wood. I think it was all consolidated to the tavern because I already didn't have that much. Look at that, it's a little piece of the black metal chest. Wait, what's in this one? Oh, I put black metal in here. Okay, so we had a little bit down here. Because we're gonna be needing it for the chest, so I wanna get it pulled down. Okay, um, what was I doing? Why'd I come down this way? God damn it. Uh, hold on. Okay, let's get these resource piles made real quick there we go I'm like where's the angle there's a, a certain angle you can just spam it down and not even have to move the view okay there Jesus good golly Jiba Now we have a free cart, so let's bring this up to the top so it's ready to move black metal down. Because we are gonna need it. Just gotta make it up there. There we go. I'm like, we just gotta be slow and methodical about it. I wish if I just, like, parked the cart here, it would just fill into the cart automatically. We had some kind of, like, hopper chest, so it would just automatically collect the stuff when it falls on the ground. Oh good, I have coal.
no more. There we go. I know it'd be easier to aim at it with the mouse, but I can spam uh, quicker with the button than I can with uh, pressing E. But it's because I'm right-handed, so I can click faster with my right hand than my left hand. Okay, um... Let's go back. We have a lot more shit we need to pull through. So there's more stuff in here. Let's go ahead and grab all that. And I think we can grab... Okay, there. We'll be back for the other two things in a moment. I say a moment, it's gonna be like 10 minutes before we get back, or hopefully not that long. I do exaggerate too, though. <laughs> then we can just drop down. Good thing we don't take like extra fall damage for having like a shit ton of weight on us. Alright. And the bones go in the obliterator, which we could have just put in there as we were next to it, but we don't think. Go put the gold up. We have a fair amount of gold again because I haven't bought things in a while. Uh, once we get the general goods store. Or, um, no, yeah, I think it. Oh, no, because there's going to be a lot of outfits. We might make, like, a, the barber shop be, like, a tailor shop as well. And um, have all the, the clothing, or, uh, the apparel items be on armor stands in the the general goods. I think that'd be neato. Here, I'm gonna move that right there. So then I can keep those stairs here for now. And then can just waddle down them easily. Alright, let's fill this back up. And then we'll head back. I'm trying to keep things going, everyone. Between, like, ores smelting and going out and collecting stuff. Okay, let's just grab these two things, and they're not worth an entire trip back. Let's just put them back in there. And... We're gonna bring that with us. As well as, uh... Oh, shoot. Um... We need ten wood for a workbench. Okay. That's fine. We can leave the five wood in there. If we need to sleep here, we can light that fire. Okay, so we had gotten everything we wanted from the fulling camp that we had been at. So we're going to look around a little bit for another one. I'm going to leave these locks alone. I don't feel like tangoing right now. Oh, I see something that way. Oh, let me zoom back in. Oh, it's the tree line.
All right, let's go further south. We're looking for a full in camp, which if we can't find any more this way, um, I will just uh, head back to the portal and um, we'll go to the other planes that we have a portal at because I know there's more camps there that I haven't looted. Um, let's see. I could consume more sausage. You see something that way. Is that... Oh, that's my, my stuff. Okay. Oh, alright. He's coming with us. Nope. Oh, okay. That's funny. You know what? Uh, I gotta clip that. There we go. forgot my keyboard and mouse were plugged into the Xbox, so I tried to move it real quick, and that's why my view went down. <laughs> okay, how damaged is this now? Damaged enough that it's worth placing this down to repair it. Is this natural mist into Mistlands mist? Okay, yeah. Oh, there's a... Alright, there's some fullings right here, though. I don't have my wisp light with me, so this is gonna be a little obnoxious, but... Let's, uh... Park my cart by these trees, so I have a little... Let me out! God damn it. I realized I had the hammer pulled out now. That was my problem, but... We don't want to lose the cart, so... I don't feel like going home just for my wisp light. Ooh, a totem. Does that just give bones? Or just just wood? Give me your black metal scrap. That is what we are after. I require it. I must fulfill my desire to have black metal chests. Didn't even have a chance. Talking shit like they're not on passive right now, so I don't get the first swing on them every time. And most times I'm able to just one hit them. I like it though, it's been real chill. Okay, I think that's all the fullings. I don't hear any more laughing. I hear a rabbit or a hare, but we're gonna ignore that. I don't have my wisp light, so I can't see it. Plus, they're hard to hunt anyway. These trees? Yeah, like, it was w one of these trees out here. So, we'll keep looking, but I'm convinced that there's not, uh... Also, there's, there's nothing in this. Why am I being so silly? There we go. We can travel so much quicker without that being hauled. We just put the materials in our pocket and build it when we need it. Look at me. Thinking with my brain. Oh. Falling camp. I guess I spoke too soon. Stabbed in the face. God damn, 482 damage. Okay. There we go. Nice, there's black metal scrap in the chest. I 
know I have the difficulty on easy, but like, this sword just absolutely destroys them. Oh. Okay, there we go. I didn't even see that chest there. Or if I did, my brain did not acknowledge it. over like on the edge of the mist lands though it's crazy it's so hard to see if I had known I would have grabbed my mist light I think I have a rule about not working in the dark. Okay. Metal, and then we'll go back. And then we'll come back. Such as the cycle of the Valheim light. God, all my weight just comes from the black metal because it's so heavy. I've got wood on me, not very much, but it'll go straight to the kiln. Got a few things to put away, and then we'll go sleep before we head back. Which will sleep in the tavern, since it's closer, instead of running all the way down to the house. I think for the boss summon items, besides whatever we need to summon the queen, we just need to get more, uh dragon eggs. I have one marked on the map, I just haven't gotten it, and I still need two more after that, plus I want to see if you could put one on an item stand. I'm gonna imagine they might be cool and let you, but you never know. There's other things that I feel like should go on the item stands that you just can't. Like a carrot. that flax yeah uh, we'll put that up top let's fill this sucker up Um, actually. 
There we go. Glad I thought of that. And we're good to go back. Try to be as quick as I can. Keyword, try. All right, let's finish breaking this tower. I hear a brute, but I can't see him. He's up in the fog somewhere. Okay, so that can start breaking. Oh, there's the brute. same thing and get this one breaking. Is it... Did it... There was one. Okay. Couldn't tell. Genuinely. Alright, let's drop the cart for a moment. Oh, I've been calling these guys brutes, sorry. Berserkers. Berserk that bitch. No, I'm joking. Alright, let's commit more vandalism against these guys. That one had a hat. What a fancy little guy. Also, oh, it's from the tower. I'm like, what the hell is all this? What? And then I was like, oh, yeah. Yeah, that thing that I did. That's not need to go in there. Well, I think by the time we're done looting, we'll have enough black metal for all of the chests. But I don't know how much black metal we'll have after that. Our stamina regen. Do, 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 and we're good. I know it wasn't fully fully regen, but that's fine. I think just one more camp and we'll call it good and get back to working on some other stuff. Because we still have to go farm wraiths in the swamp because we need chains desperately. We can't make any more hanging lanterns. We used the last of them on 
the trophy haul, which I mean, it was well worth it, but like, we just don't have any more now, so. And you cannot craft chains, which is the, the biggest sad fucking moment in my life with this game. It's like, what the hell? I thought with like iron, you'd be able to craft it. Even if they make you wait till you get the black forge, I would be okay with that. Like, make it be like worse than Minecraft's recipe for chains. Two iron for one chain. I'm willing to pay that. Just let me craft chains. Sure, I could go loot some sunken crypts, but there's only a chance for it to show up in chests. Decently high chance because I seem to get uh, chains every time, but it's not very many chains, even with the three times resource collection. We're gonna have to make a few trips back and forth. Okay, that didn't work. Also, I forgot, because they were up in the tower. Let me grab just a few more things. Okay, was that, was that all of it? Besides that? Okay, cool. And did it go up on the hill at all? A little bit. I mean, this man is here. Okay, it looks like I got his stuff. Honestly, don't know. I don't see any sparkles, though, so I'm pretty sure we're good. Um. Here. And then we can get all the wood in one trip. Just trying to think ahead. It takes a minute to load from, like, through the portal getting back to the base now because of all the stuff we have. Or back to the town. Um, the gold and then the bones, yeah, before I jump down. God damn, they drop a lot of gold. I still need to make a treasury. It's where we're gonna store all of the valuables for the money and like treasures. Uh, creature head. No, come on. There we go. Flint, flint, flint. Also, we do have wisps over here. Okay. Needles. Gonna have to go put the boar skin down in the tavern. And this is why we're working on getting all the black metal for the chests for the new warehouse because we're running out of goddamn space. It's okay though. We knew it was gonna happen eventually. And I always knew I was gonna have to upgrade, I just didn't know how much. All right, um, we're ready to go back and then get the wood and then we'll come through 
and we'll get more of it smelting in the kilns. Dang it. And then let's go grab some coal real quick. Be smart so I don't have to run all the way back down there and then back. Just grab the 20 and then we'll run through. I try to be efficient. It's not super easy for me. I'm a very like slow paced player. But I imagine some people are here for that specific aspect because like, I know watching like Ambiguous Amphibian, he's a content creator, he streams, he makes YouTube videos. Uh, I love that man, he's so funny and like, he's just very creative and like, I love his like narrative storytelling with his videos. Um, he, uh, oh, what was my point? Um, Wow, I don't even remember my fucking point. Oh well, an unapologetic um, endorsement for Ambiguous Amphibian. Oh, Jesus Christ, that's what I was gonna say. Uh, like with with Project Zomboid and like RimWorld, he's done a lot of like grindy gameplay on it that it's like I can just not bring myself to do, but I enjoy watching other people like do that grindy gameplay. So then I imagine it's almost like the same thing with Valheim. Like people are enjoying me grinding because they don't have to do it and they get to see it or whatever. And, um,. Uh, same reason I enjoy watching other people grind on things that I wouldn't want to take the time to and like seeing the things that I can build there's still a lot more to add and there's a lot more that could be in here okay yeah we'll head back now uh I have been in need of fine wood for a while um and there are birch trees right here I know there's birch trees over by Hilder, but I keep forgetting to get some fine wood, so. I'm gonna get like four stacks of fine wood, so we might be here for a minute. Honestly, I shouldn't be planting uh, beech trees on the, uh, the hill. I should be planting the birch trees because I get plenty of regular wood from it and I need fine wood still. I tried to get oak seeds, but I don't know if those are a thing. I've cut down like three oak trees, I believe, and I haven't gotten any. But they drop even more fine wood than uh, the birch trees, which is why I like oak trees. Alright, just a couple more trees and I think we'll have the wood. Uh, maybe like three or four actually. I thought I had more fine wood in the cart already. Got like a little over a stack and a half. I want to get four because we've been needing a lot of fine wood. And we're going to be using 20 of it immediately when we go back because I want to get another blast furnace going. Let my stamina regen. There we go. Okay, yeah. Now just a couple more trees and then we'll be there. Quite certain we will at least.
We'll see how much we have once we get back to the cart. And then we'll kind of see, gauge from there how many more trees. Okay, yeah. We'll see... That was 26. How much do we get from over here? Nine. Okay, I think like one more tree will do then. Fuck down, tree, goddamn. Was running around like a chicken with its head cut off. Oh, yep. Cool, I got more than what I was going for. Which I am not upset about. Alright, let's go through. We'll drop the stuff off. And, um... Then we'll come back and look for another camp and try to get even more, uh, scrap metal. Because I think, like I said, I think we have enough for the chests, but I want to go ahead and just get some more. This is what we've collected so far, plus um, that's what we have for refined metal, and then like another like 9 or 10 on the ground. Uh, shit, here. Let our stamina regen, and then we'll pull the wood back out. Didn't know if that would work. It did not. Uh, well, here. Sorry. Sorry, everyone. I don't mean to be so indecisive. Let's put the fine wood in there so we don't accidentally put it in the smelters. Or the kilns. Okay. Put the wood up. Put the coal up. Amazing. Fill this sucker up. Let's grab the fine wood. What else do I need? for one of these. Five cores, 20 stone. Let's go get that real quick then. Oh no! I didn't, didn't look at my health, shit. Well, that's a, that's another f fall death, or death from falling. Uh, mark that down in the books, it's like death number like 32. Unfortunately, we were just up here. And we have the death penalty set to casual, so I don't think... I don't even know how much our skills drain. Oh, our jump went down one. It was at 76. That's unfortunate. Okay. It was five cores and 20 stone? Yeah. Also, for that death, I never claimed to be good, so I'm kind of trash at games. And that was an easily avoidable death. If I had just looked at how much health I had, I would have eaten food and then probably just taken the stairs since my health just wasn't there to jump. Um. Oh, and then the 10 iron.
Okay, and we'll just slap it right there. I know it's not like super consolidated, but whatever. Let's get the fine wood down. See, we have enough health this time. It took like 38 points of health and we had like 36, so we all just barely didn't survive that. It's kind of sad, honestly. We were just so close. And then we'll repair those. And let's grab some coal and get these going again. Oh. I need to get some ore in that first one then. Some more ore. Okay. Let's get... How much have these burned through? Yeah, that's enough to... Go ahead and fill them back up. Sorry. Finish my thought. Okay. And then we'll go sleep real quick. Sleepy time, sleepy time, time to do the sleepy thing. The sleepy slips. Come on. Good God. Getting stuck on everything. <laughs> Honestly, that's how it usually goes. Okie dokie, artichokey, let's get back to it. Oakley dokley. I gotta put the resin down here. And let me grab birch seeds. And go plant them real quick. Let's just, uh, let's just go plant these in the tree line. Quite the run over here. I love it. And then we'll get back to collecting black metal. Alright, we're just going to plant a bunch of these, maybe not all 100 plus that we had, but... We'll get a lot in here. And then when we get the, the beech trees cut down the next time, we just won't replant them and we'll plant more birch trees. Because we're going to need a lot of fine wood for all the item stands I want to put around. Oh my god, my frames are struggling around here because I'm on the edge of, like, my town. And it's starting to unload some of the other side of the town.
Okay, yeah. We're almost done. I'll plant a few more. Even though I'm clearly going to be building over this way, but... Okay. We'll save the rest. I'm going to go put the cultivator up and then the seeds up. Actually, let's put the seeds down here. I need to get a second chest down here just for tree seeds. We'll get there. Wait, did I have... No, okay. Well, now we go back to the portal. And we hope to find another falling camp. If not, we'll have to go to the other planes. Sweet. It's not very many chests though. It takes six ingots per, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. So it's expansive. But it's worth it, because I mean, like, literally, look at that storage space, everyone. Okay. Put that up, put the coal up, and I think we're good to go back. Yep, we're good to go back. Let's get the portal and the table. So let's just run this way, and it's not super foggy today, so we'll be able to see further off. Let's hope we can find another one. Another one. Ooh, ah, uh, ooh, ah. Uh. Bad cart. We're not gonna worry about trying to maneuver around that. I guess I'll go ahead and mark this one too. Seems silly not to. Is that literally another tar pit down there? Oh wow, okay. Alright, um, well, let's just keep looking. I'm not seeing any structures yet, but as you can see, it's not quite loaded the distance in, so. Oh, oh, I see a falling tower. It's not a whole camp, but it's something. Do, 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 do. Should have just picked up the cart. I don't know what I'm doing. Being a dingus, that's what. Oh. I guess they didn't build their structure right. You guys need to learn how to build, you little, little nerds. Nah, I don't know. 
I guess it just didn't generate in right and like some of it collapsed. I'm not really sure exactly what happened. Get slapped. Oh, damn it. Well, oh, shit. Oh my god. I'm having, like, actual serious skill issues, everyone. Okay. There we go. Hello, I like it. Dang it. Okay. A fool I have been. Okay, let's go home. God damn. It's fucking blast furnaces and the kilns, just all of the sound all at once. It's so intense. progress on it I think we're gonna call that good on getting black metal although I gotta get my my cart unfortunately and the portal so we're gonna run back shouldn't take too long though because we'll pick the cart up and bring it with us Okay, and then the needles. Also, we can take our armor off. We're not going to be doing any more creature slaying for a little bit. Wait. No, hold on. Ooh. Okay, yeah, that that works out. We can, um... When it turns nighttime, we're gonna head over to the swamp and kill some wraiths. Because... I really need to start getting some chains, and I need to see how many chains they drop with the three times resource collection, if it actually even be worth fighting them or not. Okay, let's let's give the tower another glance just to make sure I didn't miss anything that it dropped. Oh, okay, a couple pieces of stone, but that's fine. Yeah, no, we're good. And I don't feel like breaking any of this, so.
map. Oh, okay, we're not that far. We just need to make it back to the Yagloth camp. Or the boss summon area. That I think that's a little closer, actually. I can't believe there's another tar pit just right over here. Okay. Moving along. Check this shipwreck out. I know I already looked at it, but like. Oh, there is a chest. Oh my god, how did I miss that? Huh. I'm special. We already knew that, though. Um. Should I build a cart here? No, I don't think I'll need one. Honestly, I don't think I even need the... The portal at the, the boss shrine. Let's go grab that stuff. Because there's no big tall rocks to break here. I think I broke the couple that were here. And we have a portal down here already, so it's not like we need it for that. Oh, hey. We'll just go ahead and put that on there. We're going to need to resummon him at some point. Not anytime soon, but... uh. We're going to need to get another boss head from him. But we'll do that all on one stream of like, we'll go through every single boss at one, like one after another. We'll spend a, the probably the stream before it, like getting all the materials and stuff prepped that we'll need to do all those fights and preparing the boss fight areas. And then once we're fully prepared, we can do the fight. Okay, yeah, we're ready to leave. Okay, so which, um... I should have looked at what it was named. What portal was at uh, the Yagloth boss, boss spawn area? Um, maybe that that would have been okay. That was the portal that was into the um, the storage room before. I couldn't remember. I was like, what the fuck was that portal? I figured it out. Um, cart? Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, yeah. We'll do that in a moment.
pine wood. And then I need how much for the cart? 20. Okay, um... Let's go build the cart in the cart corral. Oh, because that's where I got it from anyway. That's right. Okay. Let's get more black metal scrap smelting. And we're going to have to wrap pretty soon. I'm getting pretty dang tired. But we will be streaming again later on. I gotta sleep, but since it's already uh, Wednesday, I don't want to say tomorrow. So we'll say I'll just say Wednesday night to clear up any confusion. I will be streaming Wednesday night, so I'll be there. You know, just hours, hours later today. But my brain's still in Tuesday because I haven't slept yet. Okay, let's get more wood going. And then I'm gonna get some of this iron going since I have so much coal backing up. So they're filled up with fuel, they just need iron. No, they're not filled up with fuel. Okay. We're getting it going, everyone. Still have so much left to smelt, but I don't feel like making a third blast furnace. So we're just gonna deal. Okay. 
we're we're like just a few minutes out from wrapping up the brain has like almost completely shut down at this point Oh, no, why did I do that? Okay, let's get the furnaces filled back up or the smelters. Alright, let's go slumber, and then, well I guess I don't have to sleep, we're gonna be wrapping up, I would absolutely love to keep streaming, but unfortunately it is too late, and my brain will not let me. So, <clears throat> thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Uh, if you enjoyed the stream and you're not following already, uh, please be do sure. Uh, please, please, oh my gosh. Uh, please follow if you want to see more. Don't feel obligated. That's what I was trying to say. Um, if you do follow, it's greatly appreciated. Uh, any level of engagement, whether you're just lurking or you're a chatter, Again, greatly appreciate it. Uh, I will be streaming uh, around 8 p.m. Uh, may maybe doing a, a midday stream as well. I'm not for sure. Um, we'll be streaming more Valheim. Um, so stop by uh, 8 p.m. Central Time and for, for that. Uh, you know, like 18 hours from now or however many uh if if you do if you are following and you want to see more i have a vod channel it's lrg vods the first uh social link on my twitch uh you can find it through all my other links if you follow me on twitter or join my discord server i have all my social links there um i have a main youtube channel where i make random gaming and non-gaming videos if you like the general vibe you can check that out too if you want um but yeah, uh, so yeah, thank you all so much for watching, and I, I will see you later. Goodbye.